The 24th Association of Southeast Asian Nations, or ASEAN Leaders Meeting, opened there on Sunday morning, an event that Myanmar President Yu Tien Sen described as a symbol of unity and dedication for building a better future for the region and the peoples. <laughs> President Ten Sein and the people of Myanmar welcomed the leaders of ASEAN and their delegations for the 24th ASEAN Summit, which took place in Myanmar for the first time. Lao delegations led by the Prime Minister Tong Sing Tamawong was among heads of states, governments of all ASEAN member states arrived in Nepido, signaling the start of the 24th ASEAN Summit. <laughs> In his opening speech, Myanmar President Hun Ten Sen said, It also reflects the importance that we attach to our collective and coordinated endeavors to promote peace, stability, and economic prosperity of our region and the well-being of our people. Themed, Moving Forward in Unity to a Peaceful and Prosperous Community, the summit is expected to review the progress towards the realization of the ASEAN community by the end of 2015 and discuss ways to overcome challenges in the process of economic integration. Noting there are only one and a half years ahead, President Wu Ten Sein stressed it is imperative to take a comprehensive review on the implementation of the blueprints for ASEAN community and to ensure that the targets are fully realized in a community building process. He said we are at a critical juncture and we need to make sure that all necessary steps in the community building are taken in a timely manner for the realization of ASEAN community. The leaders will also deliberate the ASEAN Community Post 2015 vision and reiterate ASEAN commitment in its collective efforts for a single market and production base. The President stressed it is also equally important to map a clear direction for the ASEAN community beyond 2015 to keep it relevant to this changing global environment. In this regard, ASEAN leaders should take into consideration the changing political environment and social cultural developments of the region and the world, he added. Prior to the 24th Association of Southeast Asian Nations or ASEAN leaders meeting kicks off, Deputy Prime Minister and Foreign Minister Tong Lun Si Sulit also attend the summit and join the ASEAN Foreign Ministers' meetings. Created in 1967, ASEAN groups Brunei, Cambodia, Indonesia, Laos, Malaysia, Myanmar, the Philippines, Singapore, Thailand, and Vietnam. Myanmar, which hosts the ASEAN Rotating Presidency this year, hosted the ASEAN summit for the first time since it joined the regional bloc in 1997. The ASEAN community comprises three pillars, namely the ASEAN political security community, the ASEAN economic community, and the ASEAN social cultural community. Each pillar has its own blueprint and together with the Initiative for ASEAN Integration or IAI Strategic Framework and IAI Work Plan Phase 2, 2009-2015, they form the roadmap for an ASEAN community for 2009-2015. During the summit, the ASEAN leaders reviewed the progress of establishing the ASEAN community in 2015, in particular the implementation of the three pillars of the ASEAN community through the ASEAN political security community, in particular the implementation of the three pillars of the ASEAN community through the ASEAN political security community, the ASEAN economic community, and the ASEAN social cultural community. The leaders also reviewed the plan of initiatives on the second period ASEAN Link, the ASEAN Link Master Plan, and their cooperation with countries outside of ASEAN. The leaders adopted the NAPIDO Declaration on the establishment of ASEAN community in 2015 as the main priority. 
They also discussed the future direction of ASEAN after the community has been established next year and exchanged comments on the outstanding issues in the region and other international areas.